Welcome everybody to an $8,750,000 condo in Grove at Grand Bay in Coconut Grove. This building is actually an award-winning design for architecture because it's that twist building in Coconut Grove that everybody loves. The unit itself is just over 4,000 square feet of living space with four bedrooms, four and a half baths, and a huge wraparound terrace with some of the most beautiful bay views. So without further ado, let's show you this spectacular unit. Welcome everybody to a condo that kind of feels like a house because it's so big. You walk in from your private foyer over here, you put down your keys and then you walk into the space over here. You notice this custom millwork, which is really nice. They have the LED lighting, sticks out in certain places and then not in others, so it gives you a really cool design. And you walk into the space here, which is kind of like a flex office space. I think it's great for the kids. They do their homework over here, get their homework done, you sit here, you make sure they're not copying off each other, they're doing their homework, or you could just use it as kind of like a little seating area or your office, right? Now, as we mentioned, there are four bedrooms in this unit, right? We're gonna walk down over here. Uh, there's four and a half bathrooms. This is the half bath, this is the powder bath over here with a really nice floating vanity with the stone all up along the wall and a nice big mirror. Right, and then here is your living spaces with your kitchen. But first, let's come over here. I wanna show you the bedrooms. You have one bedroom over here, two, three bedrooms, all ensuite bedrooms. Show you this one over here. I wanna show you the corner bedrooms. I think the corner bedrooms are worth seeing, right? So here you have your walk-in closet with a Christmas tree. And then over here you have the bathroom, which is really nice. You have the view of the water floor to ceiling glass windows. And this is actually a wallpaper. It's not, I thought it was textured. I thought it was like things that stick out like 3D, but it's actually not. It's a little like uh, tricky, tricks you there, right? <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, look at that, who's that? Oh my gosh, we found him, we Surprise. found him. Surprise, Nico, Nico's hiding, you know, he hides in all the videos. Comment down below where you think he's gonna hide in the next video, you know, Easter egg. <laughs> Isn't it so funny? It's really, it's, it's funny looking at him just oh sitting God. there. So anyways, this is the uh, first bedroom that we see here. It's a corner bedroom. You have nice big windows here. You see the column in here too. And then you're looking out to the water. And then over here, you see the coconut, co coconut grove view. And you see the view of Coral Gables as well, which is nice. It's a big bedroom though. Come over here. So you have the two closets, one there and one here. Now we're going to show you the laundry rooms over here. Okay, you have the second bedroom here, which has bunk beds, it has two twin beds. It's a big room with the, one of the columns too, which I love the columns, I really do. And then you have the uh, bathroom with really nice wallpaper too. And this is the third and final bedroom over here. Different wallpaper in all of the bedrooms. This one's really cool, it has sailboats, right? Reminds you that we're on the water. That's what I think the blue reminds you of, right? Which is really nice. Sailboats right here in the art. Uh, but you look outside the window and you'll see sailboats and water, real ones. <laughs> and all the bedrooms connect to that wraparound balcony. The wraparound balcony goes from this room over here all the way to the primary suite. It's a true wraparound balcony. Usually sometimes you see wraparound balconies and it's like, wraps around like a quarter of the way. Like that's not a true wraparound balcony. This is true, because it's the whole unit. Now, living space is over here, all right? You have your living space right here. Watch some TV, really nice. It goes flush into the, into the, uh, into the furniture here, which is really nice. And then you have the column here. This kind of reminds me a lot of 1000 Museum, where in 1000 Museum, you see the columns and the arches in the building and every unit has a different, is in a different part of the building, so the column is in a different way. And that's unique with this building too. So this is where you're gonna watch TV. TV, you can hang out and it's really nice because it's right off of the kitchen. So you have your breakfast nook over here, your living space overlooking the water view. You have wine fridge over here. This is basically an area for you to prep. You can make it like a coffee station, but actually you don't need to make it a coffee station because you have your Mila coffee maker right here with double oven and the microwave. And of course we can't forget the Sub-Zero refrigerator and freezer here. Panel ready. If it ain't panel ready, it ain't ready. This is your island here. This is a Cristallo quartzite countertop, which is beautiful. This is the best of the best when it comes to counters. And it's a waterfall counter here. And you look out, you see those views. Sink over here, the Cristallo quartzite countertop continues on the backsplash and you have a gas cooktop and you look to the right, 
and you see the water. Now, these floor to ceiling glass windows and doors really make this unit so, so special. The amount of light that you get in here is out of this world, right? This is the living space here, 12 foot ceilings right over here, dining room with a big mirror here that you look, I see myself, but I also see the water and sailboats, right? And you look out to those windows, it's unbelievable. But this is a nice big entertaining space. This is where you're gonna spend most of the time entertaining. And you also can access this from the entryway or from that flex space that we saw in the beginning, right? And you'll notice as well, this wall has that custom mill work as well with the LED lighting, which is really, really nice. And the primary suite door is actually that same mill work, so it kind of blends in when you have it closed. You'd never know the primary suite is there. Now, here you're getting a really nice view of this water over here, the bay views, the boats, right? That's what Coconut Grove is about, right? But come over here. This is the primary suite. Look how big this primary suite is, right? King size bed, the two nightstands, then you have a bench here, and they made it a custom bench that wraps around, hugs the column. It's just cold. It's like cold on my face. Anyways, you can access the balcony here, right? The wraparound balcony, the true wraparound balcony, right? And then you come over here and you have this big walk-in closet. Look how big this is. This is like a, you put your clothes on, What would you call that, George? Catwalk. Meow. Over here you have the, I thought that was one behind you. <laughs> Over here you have the, I'm like, if someone saw me do that, that would be, that would be awkward but funny. All right, well, I guess people are seeing me do that right now. <laughs> Anyways, this is the bathroom here. I really love the tile that they put, right? You have this really nice tile throughout the entire bathroom. Very, it's grays, whites, kind of modern. But then you look at the vanity here, right? Vanity's wood, right? It brings the wood. So now it kind of feels like a spa kind of feel. Look at this. You have an area for your soaps. You have an area for your toothbrushes if you want. It's a really cool design, unique design there. You have a shower, the tub, rain shower up there. And then you have two water closets. There ain't no sharing of the bathrooms, right? The water closets are separate, which is nice. Come on over here. I want to show you the wraparound balcony. I think it's worth showing because it's one of my favorite things about this unit. Now this is my favorite part because like we mentioned, it's a true wraparound balcony. It wraps around the entire unit from primary suite to that last bedroom. And it's 12 feet deep over here, so you have plenty of space. So you can have couches and seating areas and a dining table here. And then over on the side, you literally have, you could run a 40 yard dash. It's a huge balcony that extends all the way to the other end. So you could run back and forth and get some exercise if you want just up here, right? Who could run a 40 yard dash on their condo balcony? I'll wait, can't find it anywhere, right? But this is a really special building and a special unit, right? Um, we saw the entire unit about the building itself. We're in Grover Grand Bay. Like we mentioned, it's an award-winning design, right? It's that twisty building, right? It's the building that everybody looks at when they drive by and say, oh my gosh, look at that design. It's award-winning for a reason. It's a beautiful building. You have four pools, a rooftop pool on each tower, right? And then two pools down below. This tower has 40 units. The other one has 58 units, right? You have a gym, of course. You have spa. You have a butler on site. You have a concierge. You have security, right? And talking about location, right? You're literally close to everything. Right in front of you, on the other side of the street, you have the fresh market. You have anatomy, the gym. You have Regatta Grove. You have restaurants. You have a park. And then right behind is Coco Walk. So you can go to dinner or go out in Coco Walk. Or if you want to hop in the car, minutes away from Brickell. Right in the middle of everything, some of the best bay views, and honestly, I think one of my favorite buildings in all of Miami. That's the end of the tour. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you go down, like, subscribe, and comment, and we'll see you guys in the next tour. Peace and love as always. Thank you 
so, so much for watching the tour. If you like what you're watching here, we got a few other videos for you to watch. We do them every single Sunday. We got one property tour right here and, and the most recent one right over here. And make sure you go down and subscribe as well and we'll see you in the next video.